Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel or welcome in if you are new. My name is Dream and today we're gonna do another great video. It is a home update and I have not done one of these probably since eight months we had been in our home. Now we've been in our home a little bit over a year. Um, a little backstory really quick. We moved from California um, a little bit a year and some change ago and we bought a new built home in the Dallas, Texas area. So we came here, we transferred my husband's work. So I'm going to show you guys our powdered bathroom on our first floor. It was pretty simple, pretty standard and we wanted to do a Fresh it a little bit, not spend a ton of money, but just make it more ours. So let's go check that out. So this is our powdered bathroom right off of the entryway. Um, the floors we left the same because they run throughout our whole first floor. So we wanted to leave those the same, but oh my goodness, I put in the picture of the before for you guys, and this is the after. What a difference some Wayne Scotting made. And we did it all the way around. And then I painted it, um, we painted it a gray color. Um, the exact name of the color I will have, um, it's by Sherwin Williams, but I will have it link down below. So the exact gray um, color that we use, but this is it. Um, the mirror we changed out when we first moved in and we changed that to this one. I picked it up at Home Depot. The hardware is still the same. Um, it's by Moen um, that we got from when we had our house built. Um, the pedestal sink we left for now. This bathroom, I don't really need it for a ton of storage, so the pedestal sink works well. The soap dispenser there is from Target. I found this little wicker shelf from um, Amazon. It was under $20. I think it's cute and I have it kind of styled for the fall season, but I, I'm going to like having a shelf there so I can style it for all the different holidays. On the toilet, I just have a basket with tissues and then some room spray from um, Hearth and Hand at Target. And then we have, like I said, the hardware was the hardware. It's Moen that when we bought our home, that was here. I just have this wicker basket over here. In this corner, let me close the door so you guys can see everything. I am looking actually for like a vintage plant stand and I want to put a plant there. And then ideally for Christmas time, I would love to have like a vintage tree in that corner sitting on the plant stand, but we'll see what I can find. So the bottom is the wainscoting, which we got everything from Lowe's, and the trim um, that is painted in um, the Sherwin Williams gray color that I will have linked down below. And the white is City Loft, also by Sherwin Williams. And then on the ground, I just have um, this rug. It's from, I think now, it used to be called Belks, but um, they changed the name of, it's like a little outlet store, um, or Bells it used to be called, but I have this um, rug that I love. Um, but yeah, just simple, simple changes. We didn't change much, add wainscoting, changing out the... Um, mirror and I think it updates it and it's more cozy and I can't wait to style it and just add a few more things um, in here. Maybe an art piece above the um, toilet there or maybe two art pieces above here. We did do the higher wainscoting um, and get the shorter piece but my husband wanted it the taller and wainscoting comes the thin which we chose or a thicker one. And we chose the thin just to break it up. We do have shiplap in other areas of our home, so we thought this broke it up well. But that is our little bathroom update for you guys. The next area is in, we have a huge loft area, which we mostly use as my daughter's 
playroom and um, we wanted to just spice that up a little bit as well so I will show you guys that um, we're gonna head upstairs and check that out so we are in our little loft area and this is our little computer workstation and we added it was just plain wall and we added in these floating shelves they're not styled or anything we still need to paint the nail holes with um, black paint because um, the nails that came with the brackets they were not like deep enough to go into the studs because these that wood's heavy um, that is natural oak with just a clear stain on top um, it needed something to go in good like it needed something substantial and sturdy the brackets are from Lowe's but little just some floating shelves up here I can't wait to style them um, and it's just right here with our computer um, we have our double monitors my husband will do work and stuff up here and then I edit videos and that kind of stuff up here as well our chair we love our chair that's from Amazon and my our computer desk and it has like really modern legs that is um, my husband made that so I just love how it looks and can't wait to get everything styled and to cozy it up a little bit more well guys that is it short and sweet i hope you guys like the little bit of updates that we have done to our house making it slowly a home um, i want to thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and i will see you very soon with another new video bye guys